All right, all right, all right. We are at the bottom of the momentum to grow on purpose hour. I'm filling in for Stephanie and um, Laura and I, Laura and I will just, ugh. Laura and I were just discussing, um, you know, the fact that when we get older, we get more responsibility, um, which I think comes with, you know, the building up of more experience and knowing what we can handle when we can, how much can be on our plate. Um, but we were specifically talking about our kids. So it's a little different, right? They don't know those things. Um, but I think that that's a huge thing about momentum and how we grow is, um, like being able to pull out the little things to share with the youthful, right? The younger generations when they're complaining about having a little homework or, you know, doing something extra, they're like, well, that's not my responsibility. And that's not what I, like, that's not my job. Well, it's someone's job and why can't it be you? And it's our job. Like, I do, as an adult, I do personal development every single day. Like I am intentionally um, learning something every single day to, to grow myself. And um, the momentum is that I make sure that I do something every day. So for me, that's momentum in growing the person that I am. And um, I'm always focused on like, how can I instill that more in my own kids? and um, I don't know. I think part of it too is like us being able to set the example. Like we do stuff all the time that we don't necessarily want to do, but there are things that you need to do in order to get to what you want, right? There's things that must be done to receive what we want, to have the free time to do things. We need to also show up and do the work. So Laura, so it's really that funny that you say that because, yeah. um, right now my stepdaughter is on this kick that she thinks she wants to work for NASA when she grows up. Awesome. Like, Honey, you want to work for NASA? You are going to have homework. Yeah. You are going to have more homework Absolutely. than you can even imagine right now. So you better, you better, uh, remember how little homework you have right now while you're complaining about it. <laughs> well, and, and that could, that could also be right. Like, a um, thinking about like perspective, I know that I, I've never, I'm not like, oh, I want to learn math. Oh, I want to learn science. But like, I'm excited to learn things that I want to learn. So if she's excited to say that she wants to work at NASA, like, what is it about that, that she's excited about? Because there could be something with um, the school stuff that, you know, there's more emphasis in certain back. areas. Yeah. That she can you know, get excited about, because if we're not excited to learn it, that's why, you know, it's more of the drag to have to do it because it is a have to versus, and I get to, and yes. like, no, like, it's great that, you know, that that's a dream of hers. Like if that's planted in her, then being able to like, um, and right, like, this is something that we teach in on purpose of purpose to adults is like being able to support and accountability and encouragement versus what the rest of the world generally does is guilt and shame people for not being able to do or not being willing to do the work for what they say they want. Um, but I think that that really does start at like our kids to be able to show them like you can do that. I want to instill the possibility that you could do that. But there is work to be done in order for you to receive the dream that is on your heart to work at NASA. Girl, there will be work to be had. And it will be more fun than maybe the stuff that you're doing right now because it's something that you want. But in order to get to that, like you're going through the motions of doing what needs to be done to build um, towards it. And I just think, I think that helping kids know there is possibility in what they want. It sounds far-fetched, sure. But we all start somewhere. We all had a little kid dream to be something when we were little. And I think that society and like, we're just programmed even as adults, parents, right? Like we were probably told the same stuff. Like if you want to do that, then this, then, um, right. Encourage them to say, that's great. Follow that GPS of yours. that says, this is what I want. 
and then know that there will be hard work to be had in order to receive it. Because we don't just get things on a silver platter to us. We work for them. I think it goes down to like those values of like making sure that it's clear. Someone just doesn't wake up and work at NASA. They, they put in the work to show up and do the things that um, aren't always fun. They wake up early. They pay attention to the focuses that aren't as fun because it's building towards what they actually want and see as fun or good. So that's my momentum, LT. Yeah. I love it. <laughs> the momentum to in start instilling it now so that it builds for them to have that encouragement. That's what I would I would love to just say. Encourage them to, to go for it and know it's not easy and you can do hard things. You can do hard things. So, all right, I'm going to wrap up this momentum mastermind and hand it over to you.